So this is a system that we are totally disassembling. It was done by another big company in Jamaica that uh, claimed they did a professional installation. This work was done by a large company and a well-known individual in the solar business. And we just pulled the pipes apart. Nothing is tangent if you look. Everything is loose. This is all loose piping. So you can see these couplings. There's no PVC cement. Now here is what is of concern to me. See the piece in the wire. These are the two negatives that came down. They used 2.5 mm wire, which is designed for AC wiring. That's what you'd use to wire your home. But this is definitely not recommended for a DC powered system. Now this is the two main cables coming from the roof. These are your negatives. These are your positives. Now, as you can see, this was spliced and hidden in the pipe. So they spliced the line, made a connection, and taped it back. Using, again, the wrong type of wire. This is 2.5 sheeted AC wire once again. The entire thing was wired with AC wire. This is 10 mm AC wire, 2.5 mm AC wire. And this job, the, the lines are piecing all throughout the installation so the problem the customer was having is that uh, the system was not charging properly um, they, 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 it was not performing properly at all so the solution is to disassemble the entire thing as you can see these are quality products that's a Schneider Electric MPPT60 we got the Midnight Solar Mini DC box and the panels are good panels it's a schneider electric inverter so they invested in good quality equipment but the work was poorly done and uh, therefore they had to call in the specialist so we're going to completely disassemble this system and rewire it rewire it using the proper types of wires proper gauge wires and uh, get them up and running the way the system should really be running because it's really not doing the job at all so we'll keep you posted i think we'll make a part one part two video of this So this installer did not even take the time to ensure that the panels are installed in a straight line. As you can see, all the panels are all zigzag and it's not aesthetically pleasing. It does not look good. So this, this I would give it a, a, a 1 out of 10 for installation. Uh, and that's just aesthetic. We're not even getting into the actual important stuff which is the electrical side of it. That's a whole other story with this job. A matter of fact, I, I changed my rating. I would give this a negative one out of 10. Well, as you can see, this wiring is extremely shabby. Not only is it shabby, but it is the wrong type of wire, wrong gauge, wrong everything. So what we have here is 10 millimeter wire again, 2.5 millimeter AC wire. So we're going to be replacing that with a 10 AWG DC wire with the proper insulation to handle the heat coming from the sun because even though the wires aren't exposed, the conduit is being exposed to the sunlight being on the roof 
therefore you need an insulation that can properly handle that kind of heat without getting crystallized and breaking down and therefore losing the resistance of the insulation itself I'm asked this question all the while saying you know Rory what's the difference between the wires you use for PV installation and the regular wires that are available on the market here in Jamaica uh, at the hardware store that you would use to wire a house uh, wire is wire is what they always say but in fact wire is not wire because the AC wires would have a mixture of alloys in it it's not a pure copper and uh, uh, resistance does not affect AC in the same way it does DC current so therefore the AC wire is designed for AC current and the DC wire is designed for DC uh, current the DC wire is a more copper based wire it's a uh, pure copper therefore it uh, it minimizes the amount of resistance in the line and coming from your solar panels is direct current it's a DC system at that point until it's changed over through the inverter to AC um, the entire system is a DC system okay so therefore you need to use DC wires 